crucial to remember that desirable skills are constantly changing and evolving, just like technology. So don't be reluctant to broaden your knowledge. Put yourself to the test. Lifelong learning is a process. Since knowledge is power, seek it out. No matter how challenging or impossible they may appear, you should always push yourself to try new and exciting things. Don't limit yourself to tired organizational or analytical skills. Hey, welcome to the Luxury Syndicate, where we embark on an exquisite journey to the heart of the luxurious world and share valuable financial life advice as well as entrepreneurial insights. You have reached the perfect channel if you want success in your life and business, and make sure to hit the subscribe and like buttons if you haven't already. Feel free to leave a comment. The more expertise you possess, the more valuable you are as an employee or business owner, which increases your appeal to more employers or clients. Your earning potential and the amount you can accomplish. Number one, proper time management. Folks, we all have the same number of hours in a day when we wake up, but by the time we close our eyes at night, some people have advanced more than others. Simply put, while some people make good use of their time, others choose to waste it. There are only two types of people when it comes to managing time. First are those individuals who will be upset with the universe for making life unfair, while the other group enjoys their wonderful life because they make use of their time wisely. Please don't tell me you belong to the first group. Management of time. You can invest less and prevent more conflict and issues by using time management, making a to-do list, allotting time for each item, and then putting the chores on your calendar are all steps in effective time management. Stop putting things off. It's okay to lose in occasionally, but if it becomes a habit, it will harm your success and career. Number two, self-control. Everyone's life can, in our opinion, be significantly better if they become more disciplined. People lack consistency, play the short game instead of the long game, and are easily distracted by bright goods. Don't imitate them. Success is the result of a series of tiny actions carried out repeatedly over a long period of time. You will eventually arrive at your target, no matter how little of a step you take each day. The desire to start over is powerful, but even if you are successful for a while, you will be drawn to another sparkling object and want to pursue it. That is what keeps people from making actual progress. Folks, self-control is crucial because it enables you to withstand temptation and come to wiser conclusions. You'll be more prone to make poor judgments with potentially harmful outcomes if you can't control your desires. Number 3. The ability to divide a process into more manageable steps. We all need and want billions of dollars, but do we really know where we can use that huge amount? The majority of individuals focus on the outcome. They always say, I want a million bucks, and leave without further explanation. You can see your goals more clearly if you put them in writing. This is significant because our actions are influenced by the things we perceive. If you can see what has to be done, rather than just thinking about it, you'll be more likely to get it done. That's what successful people do. If you're not breaking a goal down into milestones, you're just daydreaming. It's wishful thinking. You'll never learn this from studying literature. It's a distinct type of thinking which gives you an edge over everyone else. By breaking down your goals into tasks, you may turn them into manageable, concrete steps that you can take. You are certain that you can complete each assignment, which provides you the assurance to advance quickly towards your goal. Number 4. Being able to motivate yourself There are times when you believe your progress is slow. An individual's capacity for self-motivation is strongly tied to their certainty, their outlook on the end, the standard of their objective, and the atmosphere they establish for themselves. Not on all days you're motivated and positive. Some days you will prefer just lying down and doing nothing or don't even want to socialize with people. It is up to you to make your goals happen. Determination is the ability to persuade your body and mind to behave in a way that is consistent with what you know is better than any other alternatives. Number 5. 
respecting oneself and being courageous. Gandhi and Martin Luther King Jr. are two of the most influential personalities in history. Their deeds and tenets significantly influence society. By upholding your ideals and values, you might become influential too to many people. People will treat you as they would like to be treated, not as you would like to be treated. The most respected members of society are those who have a high level of self-respect. You have to be strong in your values. Your values are like a compass. Whatever is going on in our lives, our values can show us a path forward and help us make better choices. Number six, self-evaluation. Only what can be measured can be improved. Almost every successful individual monitors their development, regardless of the sector or field they work in. One of the primary goals of self-evaluation is to recognize your accomplishments and recall significant moments in your professional development. A thorough self-evaluation should identify particular activities and projects that showcase your greatest work, so make sure you apply this to see your progress and determine what you need to improve on more. 7. Being able to express your thoughts and feelings in words. Things will be simpler to let go in the hopes that something better arises if you are not completely honest and participating in the process. You're all wasting time as neither of the sides succeeds. Most of us are afraid to express our differing opinions, which results in a route that is defined by an unhappy phase. When it comes to your career, Professional opinion sharing among coworkers is a crucial component of workplace cooperation initiative. Discussing various viewpoints encourages brainstorming, produces fresh ideas, and results in a more efficient project planning. Number 8. Learn how to adapt and get around difficulties. There will be difficult times. People you trusted will betray you, things will not go your way, and you will have been knocked to the ground or will be soon. Change your mindset, look for alternatives, and use creativity, and you can conquer anything life throws at you. A harder life indicates that you are progressing in the life game. Only the foolish believe that they have figured out life and that everything will go smoothly from this point forward. Life is complicated and unfair, yet you can prevail because of your commitment to keep going. In life, there are occasions when we run into unpleasant surprises, being adaptive helps you stay afloat when life's challenges threaten to drag you. Number 9. Non-stop learning This is the ability to pursue and persist in learning, to organize one's own learning through effective management of time and information. The world begins to resemble a video game once you realize that you can learn any type of ability by following a certain set of tips. You can level up and gain new skills because you are aware of the level of exertion, time, and concentration required to learn a new skill. One of the most undervalued skills one may possess is this, yet it is also the one that is most likely to be most advantageous in the long run. When you know how to learn, all that's left to do is set aside the time and money necessary to enhance your system with the knowledge that will improve your life. Number 10. The capacity to come up with worthwhile ideas. Your mind is the most potent tool you possess, as we've already demonstrated. Imagine your mind as a sizable plot of productive ground where you can grow crops. The mind will produce that crop no matter what because that is what it's there to do. If you can take care of your mind, you will be able to produce high quality ideas that will enhance your happiness, success, and sense of fulfillment. In the same way, the tree requires time and sustenance to develop and produce berries. You'll quickly be able to generate more and better ideas if you continue to feed it and meet its requirements. The objective is to concentrate on valuable concepts and abilities. Ideas are limitless, and one thought has the power to change your life for the better. A series of wise decisions can simplify your life and gradually guide you in the correct direction. Number 11. Mindfulness A true balance with reality can be achieved through meditation, which is essential for creativity, invention, and most significantly, happiness. As an entrepreneur, you need confidence in your ability to move forward and not backward with each step you take. According to research, 
more than 80% of successful people engage in some kind of everyday meditation. The exercise strengthens the heart-brain connection and intuition, which can assist create a lucky lifestyle. Keep in mind that optimism and good fortune go hand in hand, folks. Number 12. Being attentive and knowing when to talk. How many people who never stop talking can you think of? If you're the one speaking, you're not learning anything new because you're just sharing your knowledge. You can only get better by actively listening. Listening entails paying attention and storing the knowledge in a mental blueprint that you can access when necessary. Because it keeps you positively involved in your discussion partner, active listening is crucial. The other person feels heard and appreciated as a result as well. Similar to reading, listening requires intense concentration in order to properly comprehend each thought and word. You can only process the ideas given by the person you are speaking to if you shut up and just open your ears for listening. Growing is more significant than appearing to be an expert in all things. Number 13. Empathy and Emotional Competence You will have to deal with people because we were born to be social. We are all part of a vast social system that depends on our ability to cooperate with one another. Lacking emotional intelligence, people become irritable, feel that everyone is against them, and think that other people are unfairly elevated in life. Understanding and controlling your own emotions are crucial, but you also need to be able to read a room. Your capacity to discern the feelings of others and the social dynamics at work is referred to as social awareness. Did you know that emotional intelligence is a skill? Is your sweet spot to engage with, comprehend, communicate with, and inspire others? If yes, then there is a chance that you have high emotional intelligence. We are not robots. We have different sets of values and respond to different disturbing or stressful situations. However, if we have emotional intelligence, it will enable us to recognize and comprehend the distinctions among people. Number 14. The competence to advertise and negotiate. Every action you take involves a sale or a negotiation. You must persuade them that you are the ideal partner for them if you desire a girlfriend or a boyfriend. If you desire a job, you must be able to distinguish your skills from those of other applicants. You need to convince yourself that you are capable of more than you currently are. Selling is a reasonable process in which you outline how your solution will benefit the other party. It is not synonymous with lying. Selling is encouraging others to work with you to produce a better result for the two of you. This directly contributes to the earlier mentioned verbalization capacity. Everyday interactions with people, with oneself, and even with time itself are negotiations. Under the guise of time, there is a negotiation between effort and fulfillment. You negotiate a future in which you can lead a life that is unavailable to others by doing things that people won't do right now. Selling is a skill that can be learned and is very useful to have. Number 15. Comprehension and Memorization Skills Instead of reading for fun, read for personal growth. Look for books that detail someone's challenges and the steps they took to overcome them. Take advantage of your free time to improve your reading abilities. We continue to be astounded by how few people are aware of the importance of books. The greatest informational leverage now accessible is the ability to quickly learn from someone's whole life experience. Never has it been so simple to get important knowledge, tactics, and guidance. Your life can be changed by just one book. Continue reading, but read to comprehend, read to understand, and read to store that knowledge. One page can give you a thought that will change the course of your entire life. The more you read, the more you'll learn, and the more you learn, the more places you'll go, as Dr. Seuss famously said. Regular reading can actually boost your brain power in addition to making you smarter. Reading often strengthens memory by exercising your brain, much like running strengthens your cardiovascular system. 
it will be challenging to learn new abilities. Take a big step towards developing a talent that will help you succeed in life if you desire it. Take give up out of your vocabulary. So which of these do you already have and which do you need to work on the most? Let us know in the comments. If you guys did enjoy watching this, then make sure to hit the like button and I would appreciate you subscribing to see more about fine living and luxurious life inspirations. This is the Luxury Syndicate. We'll see you on our next travel.